Hello everyone, how you doing? Uh, my name's Wolf, and I'm going to show you guys how to use this. It's, I guess it's an uh, asset, almost kind of an add-on. I don't know, I'll let you guys decide. Alright, let's get this installed. Alright, you guys download the zip, make sure that you unzip it. Come on, alrighty. Let's go to File Pass. Yes, by the way, you guys should get that. It's epic. All right. Now, after you unzip it, double click Add Asset. Now, you guys can label this whatever you want. I'm going to call it Hair Card Particles because that's pretty much what it is. All right. Now that I've got it installed, added, pathed, whatever you want to call it. What you want to do is go to your folder. That's not where I wanted to click. There's a blend. Open up your blend. Yes. Look how gorgeous that is. All right. Now, I made this from the hair tool. This is pretty much the same setup as the hair tool that they have. Um. I went ahead and made my own shader. I didn't want to steal his shader. Try not to steal anything of his. But also trying to provide a large variety of particles you guys can just grab, drop into your little scene here. Here's all your choices. Let's go through. In case you're not a hair tool user, because this also works. I don't even have the hair tool add-on installed right now and this is working just fine. So, alright, you can go here and see so you can just start editing whichever particle you want and you can see which choice you get in there. Make some variations. Go down here to the children. There's all kinds of choices down here for you guys to make. Braids, clumps, curls. Okay, so these are the short hairs. I also provided some long hairs. I put some um, group packs down in here so when you click this one, make sure that you go inside the group to choose these. Whoops. Is that right? Oh, thought I clicked something else. I tried to give as many varieties as I could so you guys have many choices, something close to what you need. Um, you can just grab that one, alter it. If that's not close enough, maybe something up here will be closer. But hopefully I have provided enough varieties for you guys to work with. I'm also probably going to be adding more because I'm going to be using these myself. Um, Let's see here. Um, here's some bun wisps. Wisps. You just add them on top of your buns here and you get these nice little hairs to come off. Adds more details. Right. I also provided some meshes. Ah, uh, yeah, they don't work in the blender scene. Or, yeah. Let me open a new one here. Okay, the meshes, for some reason, don't work in the blend. So if you want to use the meshes, here's how you do that. As you see, they just stick right onto the side of whatever. So put them on the side of your character's head. Um, hello. Oh, there it is. <laughs> it's just a tiny little fella. 
I did scale that to a character head so it should be roughly about the same there's no lighting so this isn't for rendered you'll have to add your own material or whatever but the the basics are here for you just to attach attach a braid uh wait I'm gonna have to fix that sorry guys shouldn't be attaching like that it should be attaching sideways but anyway I will fix that before I upload this but anyway so this is how you guys work this mod or add-on asset pack however you want to call it I hope everyone enjoys here's a little preview of everything I added Hopefully that'll be enough varieties for you guys. If not, just give me some requests and let, you, let me know what you think. Thanks. Bye.